In this lecture, you are going to switch the background image of our document based on the image that user picks. We are going to provide three images to the user. So go ahead and create a folder under your documents, JavaScript, events, create a folder called images and put any three images inside it. I have put maven.jpg, webservices.jpg and xslt.jpg which are all my courses on Udemy. You can put whatever images you want into this folder and we are going to use these images in our HTML page dynamically. Create a new HTML, new file. Copy over the select box this time. Select a image. The value will be the name of the file which we'll put in a second. The first one if you go to images, maven, the second one is web services, copy paste, I need one more option, third one is XSLT, XSLT, the value images slash, you have to pass the entire path which is relative to this file, this file, let's save it directly under events name it on change images dot html so we are saving this directly under events when we give the path to the image we have to give the relative path to this file which is images slash maven dot jpg similarly images slash web services dot jpg the last one images slash xslt dot jpg and the function will change from window dot location is equal to x to document dot body dot style dot background image is equal to here it gets a little tricky within double quotes you have to use the url function which will convert the given URL or a given string into a URL. Within sing give a single quotes, then a double quotes. Append. One more double quotes. So we are appending the value whatever is passed or passing this value whatever we get this path to this URL function dynamically. So use X right there. So URL up to here within single quotes we are passing the value and uh, then appending it again so we are closing the single quotes right here whatever single quotes we are opening for our value for the image we are closing it right here and then at the end a semicolon save it run it and i'll come back and explain it if you have any confusions there on change images dot html Open that in the browser, zoom in, select an image, I select maven and my background changes to my maven image. Similarly, if I choose web services, it switches to web services image, XSLT, it switches to the XSLT image. Go back to the editor. So here we are using the document.body.style.background image style. To this we are assigning a URL from where it needs to pick up the images and dynamically in between to that URL function we are passing our image name whatever the user picks so that it will be appended in between the URL and passed in as a parameter to the URL function. 